Welcome students in this session of Physics Nevera channel. Today we are going to know about the different system of unit. Depends upon the three physical quantities that we are going to measure the units of that one and it will decide what kind of system it is or which system it is, whether it is MKS, CGS, FPS or we are going to know about that ESI system also. And later on, we are going to know about ESI system. And this system is far more better than any other system. I will explain that one. Why this system is better than any other system? What are the advantages of that system over all other system that is MKS, CGS and FKS system? Let us start with this a system of unit. Depending upon the physical quantities such as we say, the first system that I am going to measure that is MKS. MK. S. In this MKS system, that is length, length, mass and time, it will decide which kind of system it is. The unit of length, unit of length, unit of mass and unit of time will decide the type of system it is. How? Let us see this. The unit of, in this system of unit, which system? MKS. In this system of unit, the unit of length, mass and time is meter, kilogram, second. Here I am going to write meter, kilogram, second and second and second is known as MKS system. And the second one <coughs> is CGS system. In this CGS system, once again the three physical quantities I would like to take that is length, mass and time. In this system of unit, length, mass, time, it is expressed in centimeter, gram and second. Here it is, centimeter, 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 gram and second respectively and the next one is that is FPS system in this system of unit once again the physical quantity such as length mass time it is measured in foot pound second here it is foot pound and second respectively second respectively means in mk system physical quantities such as length mass and time it is measured in meter kilogram and second respectively in case of cgs system physical quantities such as length mass time it is measured in centimeter gram and second and in case of uh, we say FPS system, length, mass, time, it is measured in foot, pound, second. This is about the system of unit that is MKS, CGS, FPS and the last one that is SI system. This SI system is international system of unit. It is international, international system of unit international system of unit yes sir system the internationally it words come from that one that means international system of unit this is about esi system so what is exactly the esi system it is international system of unit it has some sort of advantages that this system of unit, it is accepted by throughout the universe. And we say that universe means throughout the world, it will give us a complete information about the scientific views of means physical quantities in terms of its unit. And that's why this system is a better. But before that one, advantages decide whether this ESI system is better than EMKS system CGS system or FPS system. Let us see the advantages of SI system over all other systems. 
I will clean this one and I will start the advantages of that. Now we have the advantages of ESI system or we can term that why this system is better than any other system. This advantages shows us why this system is better than any other system of units. Let us take the advantages that will decide whether the system is a far more better or not. Okay, the advantages of the system. It is a metric system. It is metric system of unit. Metric system of unit. It is a metric system of unit means a multiples and sub multiples are expressed in the power of 10. How that we are going to explain. Let us consider we have the one millimeter. Now one millimeter can be converted into 10 raised to power minus three meter means it is expressed in the power of multiple of we say maybe power minus maybe power plus. That will decide that just like this one kilometer it can be taken as a 10 raised to power 3 meter. Once again, it will decide the power. Means I'm going to express that in the power of 10. Multiples and sub multiples are expressed in the power of 10. And that's why it is a metric system. As in, it was in earlier days, everyone says that I have metric pass. Actually, it is not metric pass. It is a metric pass. Metric means 10. And that's why it is a metric system of unit. So the next advantage is this one. First advantage it is over. Now this SI system, SI units, SI units are close to close to CGS units. SI units of system. SI units or we say SI system of units, SI system of unit, SI system of units are close to CGS system of unit, CGS system of unit, system of unit. Why this so? As SI system seems to be considered the friend of CGS because uh, the CGS system of unit can be easily be converted into uh, SI system or SI units can be easily be converted into CGS. Vice versa, we say. Let us take example. One centimeter is equal to 10 raised to power 2 minus 2 meter. Here it is. And in vice versa, one meter is equal to 10 raised to power minus 2 centimeter or plus two a centimeter that means I can write that as a hundred centimeter means a one meter once again one centimeter means a 10 raised to power minus two meter or one meter is equal to 10 raised to power plus two centimeter it is interconvertible means SI unit to CGS unit we can easily convert so that's why they are close to each other next one SI units are well defined, well defined and invariable, invariable. Obviously, the units in the system are well defined and invariable. That means in this system of unit, we are need to consider that yes, our units are well defined and it is invariable. Means it will never change a system in this units one by one. All the units can be well defined and it is never changes. Means that's why it is invariable. And the next that we are going to observe here, it is a rational system of unit. It is a rational system. Is rational system of unit system of unit what is this rational system of unit that i am going to explain 
here i am going to write here instead of this one because it will take more space i will take at the upper position here it is it is a rational system of unit let us explain this rational system of unit one by one see this rational system indicates if i need to consider the meter is a base unit base unit then one by one here it is decameter and then we are going to take the hectometer and then we are going to take the kilometer and here it is deci meter here it is centimeter and here it is millimeter see what about this i will explain how this system it is we say that it is a rational system of unit let us explain this one this indicate with the base unit all these units are in the multiple of 10 how if it is a base unit i need to consider it as a 1 if it is 1 deca means deca meter here it is 10 10 deca meter means 1 meter here 100 once again the multiple of 10 is a 100 again 100 multiple of 10 is nothing but 1000 means all these are multiple of 10 with a increasing order to the right and to the left it is decreasing order how instead of multiple divide 0.01 and it is 0.001 i am going to express this in terms of 10 raised to power also as it is 1 1 means a 10 raised to power 0 i can write 10 raised to power 1 10 raised to power 2 and here 10 raised to power 3 and what about this 10 raised to power minus 1 10 raised to power minus 2 and 10 raised to power minus 3 see these are all multiple of 10 maybe minus maybe plus so this is a rational system means they are in multiple of 10 means all other units are expressed in the multiple of 10 just like a deca hectometer kilometer just like that decameter hectometer kilometer decimeter centimeter millimeter these are the best example for that rational system or maybe it is also one term of matrix system now the last one that is fifth units in this system are units units in this system are universally accepted means throughout the world all the units in this system are accepted by the world throughout means all the units included in this system are accepted by the all the countries in the world and that's why this system is better than any other system let us take the revision in short the matrix system matrix system means multiples and sub multiples are expressed in the power of 10 just like this 1 mm is equal to 10 to the power minus 3 meter 1 km is equal to 10 to the power 3 meter or vice versa we are also going to take here it is second one si system of units si system of unit of units are close to cgs system of unit how we can easily convert cgs system of unit into si units and si unit to cgs units that's why this system of unit it is close to cgs system of unit 
SI units are well defined. Means units in this system are well defined. You can define each and every unit. As well as it is not changing, means it is invariable. It is a, a rational system. Best example, they are expressed in the power of 10. Just like the base unit we are going to consider as a meter, means 1, and we can express is in the power of 10, just like the 10 raised to power 0. And then later on, we have the decameter, we have the hectometer, we have the kilometer. See here it is, it is multiple of 10. 10 multiplied by 10, 100, 100 multiplied by 10, 1000. Power of 10, 10 raised to power 1, multiple of 10, 10 raised to power 2, multiple of 10, 10 raised to power 3. Here, toward the negative side, here it is 10 multiple of or divided by 10, 10 raised to power minus 1, 10 raised to power minus 2, 10 raised to power minus 3, just like this in decimeter, centimeter, millimeter. Just like that, we are going to express this is a rational system of units. And the last one, that units in this system are universally accepted. Without acceptance, we cannot cannot say that this system of unit is better than any other system of unit. Thank you.